teachers, staff, parents, special guests, and fellow Lions. Welcome to our fourth quarter awards assembly. My name is Wilson. And my name is Cedric, and we'll be your student MCs Nelson, for today. Your turn. This time, I would like to call upon our principal, Mr. Lucky, to say a few words. Good morning, Clee Wina. How's everybody doing today? Good. Aloha. Aloha. I think the kindergartners did better than you guys. Let's try it again. <laughs> Aloha. Good job, boys and girls. I hope everybody is ready to have a wonderful day today. It is one day from the end of our school year where everybody gets to matriculate. Matriculate, that means to go up to the next grade level. And we get to say goodbye to our fifth graders as they move on to sixth grade. Everybody, let's give a huge round of applause for our fifth grade class. Our fifth grade class has had to live through some of the craziest times in any generation that our, our nation has felt and having pretty much their entire elementary experience kind of gutted with COVID. And they have done a great job recovering and growing back and becoming some excellent people here because they have chosen love above all else and are starting to really embrace what it means to be empathetic, to forgive, to choose gratitude, to show empathy, and to love one another. And we want to say thank you to them for embracing those values. You guys are doing an amazing job at, at really thinking deeply about others' feelings and then taking that feeling and moving on to awesome academics. So keep up the good, good work, you boys and girls. We're very proud to have you guys all here today. We have a lot of people here as guests, and we want to welcome them all as we start presenting um, I was gonna have A plus come up and do the thing. A plus, you want to do your thing right now? Come on up, come on up. While they come up, uh, I want to say thank you again to the parents and family and guests uh, for coming and celebrating our KE this year as they really have worked very, very hard at growing this school and growing themselves to become the best people that they can be. I do want to talk, give the uh, A plus a chance to speak because they have a table back there for you guys. Um, hi, my name is Rochelle. I'm one of the youth directors for the Cleeky YMCA Child Care Program. And we have the Cleeky YMCA A-plus after school program. Um, we do have our table back there. We have our A-plus applications back there. A-plus is open for next school year. We're trying to hit our enrollment. Our enrollment is 20 to start the program. Um, we do offer subsidy for A-plus. Um, that means you can get A-plus for free. Um, we also have our summer programs that are open up as well as the Klehi YMCA. Um, it's a 10-week program, so if you guys are interested, you guys can um, see us back there, or you can go to the YMCA of Honolulu webpage where they have all the information for a -plus and all the summer school specials that are happening this year. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right, thank you very much. And without further ado, let's get the show on the road. MCs, it's all yours. Thank you, Mr. Larkin. As we introduce our awardees, we kindly ask that you hold your applause until the end of the last year's name has been called. Also, parents and guests, you will, you will have the opportunity to come up and take pictures of your awards. Please wait until you are given the key to come up. Thank you for your cooperation. Our first award today is the Quarter 4 Perfect, Perfect Attendance Award. This award will be presented to the students who came to school every day on time for the fourth quarter. Okay, perfect Attendance for Quarter 4, Ethan Rivera, Lucia <laughs> Maria Frank, Joseph Geer, Michaela King, Princess Gano, Sardan Ichi, Gia, D, Jason, Ludo Guy, Kaile, Oo Buli, Ea, Ehu, Kaden, Sakro, Jaden, Molina, 
Josiah, Peter, Shalea, <laughs> Sophia, Albano, Kairan, Zagayaga, Harry, Abad, Eileen, Bella Cruz, <coughs> Precious, Pamani, Audrey, Akare, Jeffrey, Pablo, Jordan, Santos, Naomi, Marchetta, Otosan, Aguchi, Anna Rina, Kathleen, Joanna, Yuri, Kyle, Agar, Zilin, Wu, Nathan, Malkista, Sebastian, Redejo, Evan, Macario, Caleb, Javier, Nathan, Angela, Clemente, Serene, Pampala, Nathan, Keen, Snyder, Connor, and Bernard. Let's give our awardees a round of applause. Okay, so once again, 
our GLO Awards, starting with Kylie Omotoy, oh, Kelly, McDobin Makana Pasquale, Jordan Tanura, Erica Lampago, Demian Mariano, Jadrian M. Jenny, Aubrey Noga, Jaden Molina, Carlin Richard, Isaac Tipoi, Kaylani Este, Michaela Portugal, Cindy Dabrique Martinez, Luisa Cardona, Alina A, Audrey Macare, Sitting Pao, Ben Jaylor Arce, Angel Gatsiwa, JC Rivero, Isabella Catlong, Evan Nicario, Aldrin Dakutan, Bernie Albert. Let's give them a big round of applause. Parents, <laughs> you may now come up and take your prisoner away. called the Student Growth Award. This award is given to students who have shown growth academically and or behaviorally this quarter. Mohila King, Joseph Fury, Rasella Kony, Jay Abadandam, Shaden Abuyo Lama, Aneska Alvin, Maria Nanagong, Rosaya Kudu, Ariana Kim Piper, Ivor Saran, Luke Mata, Isaiah Palmini, Kate Iona, Carol Ruevo, Sanchez Kentaro, Ramani Kalu, Kayla Este, Watson, Apoa, and they came to go. Kayla Este, the month awards for April and May. These students have shown kindness, compassion, empathy, and are helping us interact with others. Also, when when we are reading the names, please stay quiet. Thank you. So, starting off with April's line of the month. Tiare La Fredes Oh, there you are. Okay. Hawaii Malama. Madea, 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 Shereen, 
up with me, line of the month. Okay, I will be. Oh, wait. Thank you. Pianella De La Cruz. Is the best because of the Maxine Laura V. Tolaro. Ethan James Rivera. Athena, Matu, Kikiana Lia Chang, Jordan, Panahura, Gia, P, Zyler, Domingo, Vicentia, Angawan, Maria, Harris, Zachary, Kamiko, Azalea, Alafaiwa, King, Ruosan, Ismail, Matutania, Cedric, Ovaro, Leo Paul Fernandez, Sophia Bantalan, Suzanne Hepes, Athena Lisa, Kyle Agar, Reshet Kakao, Sebastian Rodejo, Nathan Bautista, Xander Agno, David Castro, Catherine Francisco, Let's give our awardees a round of applause. Grace 
Green, Caleb Romero, Jaden Romolasio, Carly Richards, Rafaela Syker, Jaden Wu. Okay, for grade five JPOs, Kyle Agal, Bernie Albert, Precious Cacao, Nelson Elimo, Sizerine Fagaragan, Angel Gatiwan, Kayla Molina, Ronald Nieves, Caleb Pasquale, Shireen Tungpalan, Danica Usilos, Elizabeth Usilos, Kiana Ria Walter, Joanna Geary, Javen Castro, Angela Clemente, Catherine Francisco, and Tuila Manea Faiba. Hey, thank you, um, parents, friends, family, students. I'm Officer Ross. Um, this is actually my last year, too, for the JPO program, so I'll be leaving, and then there's, there'll be another good officer coming in. His name is uh, Officer Pablo Tupola. Um, yeah, so thank you. But um, without further ado, I'd like to announce the JPO of the year. Kayla Molina.
Princess Haloto. Shalea Cruz. Jared Serrano. King Cyrus Bulosa. Ziggy Dombrique Martinez. Josea Falmui. Mario Zeekfer. Kyle Thomas Agai. Xander Miguel Agna. Janessa Almazan. Aldrin Dakutai. Catherine Francisco. Virgil Villa. Shira May Bellino. Angela Clemente. Nelson Elimo. Joanna Yuri. Jaden Castro. Caleb Pasquale. Nasari Sunia Sebastian Verdejo uh, This year, two of our GATE students made finalists for the Olelo Video Challenge so I just want to recognize them, Ishmael Akotania and Angela Clemente. Class, class. joy of bringing up a special student who turned in a creativity contest um, picture that was actually featured in the Star Advertiser at the Kiki Day um, uh, newspaper edition. And so, Jadrian Dipinjini, is, uh, are you in the house? Where are you at? Where are you at? Come on up, young lady. You are the proud winner and representative of our school. Let's give her an awesome round of applause and big you got a big prize, I think it's an iPad, so congratulations. It's not here today, young lady, you gotta get it later. But congratulations, it's turning good. Oh, you got it already. What? And you didn't share with me? <laughs>
we just want to take the time to recognize our amazing athletes. Whew, sorry. That was such an awesome performance. Whew. Thank you. Uh, starting with our first year athletes, uh, first year athletes get a word certificate. Samantha DeBottles. Princess Donald. Tiare Lofrade Sanoma. Erica Lompago. Aubrey Noga. Rochelle Pebenito. JC Rivero. And for our second year athletes, we want to present them with medals for the year. Starting with Angela Clemente. Shereen Cruz, I'm so sorry, Shalea Cruz. <laughs> Aldeo Dikilato. <laughs> Tasia Holland Pistana. <laughs> Audrey Macare. Ariani Pope Iwohi. Shireen Tungkalan. <laughs> and Joanna Yeh. And at this time we'd like to award our co-captains for the year, starting with JC Rivero. Our second co-captain, Ariani Poi Poi Iwohi. And for our cheer captain for the school year 2022 to 2023, Shalea Cruz. <laughs> uh, at this time, parents can come up and take pictures of your athletes. Starting with all the way from summer 2022, our girls were able to attend cheer camp during the summertime. This is them getting their awards for attending the three-day summer camp. And we were also able to go to the high school stage cheerleading competitions. Followed by that, we also did cheer bonding times by going to the Honolulu City Lights. <laughs> And of course, going to many, many assemblies. I believe this is from my second quarter assembly when we first got our new uniforms for the year. And this is for the for the great Aloha Run. We cheer on the marathoners at Kaliki Kukuhale Elementary School. They provided us with some delicious breakfast in the morning before we cheer on the marathoners. This is also us at the movie night. We like to take the time to uh, extend our gratitude to the students who came out to the movie night and helped us with our fundraiser. The girls did fundraise uh, with snacks and drinks for movie night. That's going to help us with um, our goal, money funds for our cheer camp this upcoming summer in July. These are different stunts that we learned at the cheer clinic. During a spring break, we were allowed to attend a cheer clinic with the high schools, hosted by Aloha Cheer Academy, which is a uh, pop corner cheerleading team. This is some of the stunts that we learned. The girls really progressed really far this year. I'm super proud of them. And this is us uh, cheering on the track and field runners for track and field day when we all get 
to go to the Fountain High School football field. And at this time, Coach Sherry is going to continue with the presentation while I give my spirit gifts to the girls. Thank you, guys. Sorry we're taking so long. We wanted to recognize everybody and our parents. Wanted to spirit gift everybody on the team for all the things they did this year. Um, if you're interested in joining cheer next year, sign up to be um, on the first day back to school. Um, if you have any second incoming siblings, relatives that want to join, we do start from their fourth and fifth grade. <laughs> Sam, I'm your city council member for this area, Kalihi and Kalihi Valley. So what we're going to do this morning is we're going to give a few awards to um, uh, Ruth Kaupuiki. Is she here? Where is Ruth? She's in hiding. We need to bring her to the front. I know she doesn't like the, the spotlight, but she has done so much for this school. We wanted to make sure we acknowledge her. Let's give her a big round of applause. Many of you probably see her in the office, always helping out. So, we have for you a certificate from the city and county signed by all nine council members, and a certificate from the state of Hawaii signed by the entirety of the state legislature. So, so we're, what we're gonna do is, what you folks have to do when you give a presentation, we're gonna read it. Okay, so, here we go. Um, whereas Ruth Kaupuiki spent 32 years in the Department of Education and 28 at this school, born in Kalihi, she started her career at Lina Puni Elementary and Fern Elementary as an office assist assistant before transferring to Kalihi Wana and taking over as the SASA, or the School Administrative Service Assistant, where she served through numerous principals, over a dozen vice principals and hundreds of employees, Whereas Ruth Kapuiki has displayed a dedication to this school that is strong, and so is the love that she has for her family, especially her three children and seven grandchildren. She's one of the most generous, giving, and selfless people. Her commitment to the school and community is unparalleled. When Ruth is not at school, she's often scrapbooking, watching her favorite football team, the Minnesota Vikings, reading, gardening, karaoke, or going out with friends and spending time with family. 
Whereas Route Kalikuliki was an integral part of several major projects, including fixing an old Kaliki house where a grandmother used to live, three major school renovations, renovating the basketball court from there, uh, the auditorium stage, and the building of a portable office where she was the key paperwork manager for all projects, equipment, and pay to ensure all projects were completed. And whereas within the school, Ruth Kalkwiki led the office staff, as well as the lunchroom staff, to ensure all students were receiving the best possible care and supervision. Her record keeping for approximately 100 staff members was immaculate, and all people were processed into service and paid accurately throughout her tenure. Whereas Ruth Kalkwiki directly supervised the distribution of $3 million, a $3 million budget which, when audited, had very minor errors, uh, her knowledge and skills were so well that other sasas from other schools would call her routinely for help and advice. And whereas most importantly, Kalihiwan Elementary School's principal, Daniel Larkin, said, she's been the heart of our school culture. Ruth Kokwiki chose the school colors, her favorite purple and yellow, and was instrumental in designing our school logos and mascot of the Lions, and had a hand in every major and minor decision throughout the school for her entire time here. Quite literally, because of her giving, generous heart, she's left a mark on our school that no one can replace. Yeah. And so, therefore, be resolved that the Honolulu City Council, on behalf of the people of the city and county of Honolulu, and the state of Hawaii, recognizes and congratulates Ruth Kaupuiki on the occasion of her retirement from the DOE and her time spent at Kaliiwaina Elementary School. Please stand up. Let's give her a round of applause. students, your parents, and your elders, you know, old people like me. Okay, so can you do that? Yeah. Okay, so the ones who epitomize or represent these values, and I'm going to have the council member and representative make the announcement, and the first one is, drum roll. First one is John Rakma in the fifth grade. Our good citizen awardee, John. There you are. 
So this award goes to John Rodbach, the Good Citizen Awardee for Kaliki One Elementary School Grade 5 for showing the values of cleanliness and helpfulness, following the rules with courtesy and respect. for me. Believe it or not, I used to help teach PE 50 years ago. Anybody, is anybody here? No. <laughs> you know, we used to walk the students, like fourth, fifth, and sixth grade. Yeah, back then, we had sixth grade. Across the street to Kamehameha Field, and I used to run the PE class there for the Department of Parks and Recreation. So, that was one way I helped uh, former principal Ikeda. I don't think anybody remembers him, but uh, and uh, that's why this school has always been a special place in my heart, and it still is. Okay, and that's why we have this special award. It's called the Spirit of Aloha Award, and everybody knows what Aloha means, right? Okay, it means hello. Goodbye and we love you, okay? Anyway, um, someone uh, spelled out aloha with each letter and then put a value to it, okay? So I'm going to go real quickly. Uh, A, akahai, which is kindness. L is lokahi, for unity. O is olu olu, which is agreeable, ha ha ha, -ha humility, and A is ahonui, patience expressed with perseverance. Okay, so these are the values we hope all of you can attain and pursue. Okay, but we have two special students who sort of represents what these values mean. So. What we're going to do is we have a certificate and we also have a gift card for $25 from Fisher Hawaii which they can use to prepare for their next school year as they go on to middle school. Okay, so I'd like to call up first Elizabeth Lucillos. Okay, and for the boys, it's Kyle Agal. All right, so let's give them a round of applause. State Legislature, the City Council, Kalihina Church, and the community, we want to wish all of you 
a happy and safe summer. Just continue to grow, whether you're in athletics, in academics, or even helping out in your community. Okay? Be there. was right in 2019, so the family tradition continues. Let's give them one more round of applause. As we hang the back, right back up where it belongs. All right, there you go. There you go. And it's there for life. We're almost done, we got two last things I think.
Pas, pas. Congratulations to all of the awardees today and keep up the great work. We are proud of each and every one of you because we are the Lions, we are the future. Enjoy the rest of your day. Parents, friends, family, teachers, staff, thank you so much for doing everything you do. I hope you have a wonderful day and aloha.